Hello, in this tutorial we will see one very interesting plugin called WordPress Review Plugin. You can download it from codecanyon.net and currently it is $14. Alright, so basically if you have a website uh, where you want to review some products maybe or some services, this plugin is uh, extremely useful and it can diversify your um, articles so I'm using it on my website here's one article about viral lock plugin and here's the plugin in action as you can see you can uh, put some um, criteria for example I'm using uh, I'm um, evaluating this plugin by usability performance easy to use and support and documentation and also you can set up some points and let's now see how it looks like in the search engine for example for this particular page in Google here are some stars and the rating of 99% and who is reviewing this plugin and this one can bring more attention to your visitors for example if somebody is uh, searching for uh, a smartphone review and you did a review for example for iPhone 5 um, it will show this uh, stars or whatever image you want to use and um, it will bring more attention to your visitors okay so it is a very nice plugin can see the author is from Egypt and currently it has 142 pur purchases but it is relatively new plugin which you can use for your website so let's see how the plugin works once downloaded you can see that there's very nice documentation and it can show you how to uh, upload the plugin how to install it and how to set up the plugin also you have uh, some styling lessons how to use this uh, to make very very nice uh, tables and also it has some widgets which you can use for your website All right so let's see the plugin in action I've already installed it on one of my websites so here you can see that there is a new menu for the plugin let's go through the settings of this excellent WordPress plugin okay so here you have some uh, options such as general settings styling typography and advanced settings you can enable this plugin in single posts only you can also set up the role who is allowed to rate so you can set up to no one only you can rate some products registered users guests only or registered users only all right, so let's click on no one currently and you can select the images. I like the stars images, so we will leave the stars images as default. All right, so let's save the settings. In the styling, you can select uh, a lot of stuff. For example, the review box outer border, the color of it, the review box header and footer background, the review items background, the links color, links decoration and you can put some uh, CSS which you've created by your own. Okay, so in the typography you can select some stuff for example if you are using it on Bulgarian and Russian sites you can select Kyrillic or Greek right in the typography you can also select the font the font of uh, of the plugin for example instead of using Arial font which is the default one you can select something else to impress the visitors of your website so as you can see there are a lot of possibilities you can read the documentation and set up plugin as you wish so there are also advanced options to export or import some settings all right so let's
create one article with this plugin. For example, let's take this one. And down below, you can see that there's a new option here for the, this plugin. You can currently disable it for a particular post, put it on the top of the article, on the bottom, and on the custom position. So you can use this shortcut. So let's use the shortcut and put this review maybe here. All right, so let's play around. We can use images, percentages, or points for our review. So let's uh, leave it on images, review box title. Let's say review example. And the text appears under the total score. Let's say amazing service. Amazing service. Review uh, summary. You can put something like I like sky painting and decorating services a lot. Excellent. Excellent service. Okay. And we can add some criteria here. For example, let's say usability or let's say performance we'll be reviewing the service All right we can add new criteria here on time job let's add new criteria and let's say friendliness okay and now we can we can add some numbers here for example for the performance we'll choose 81 for the on-time job 100 and the friendliness let's say 92 okay so let's update the page Right, so in the custom fields here, you will see that we have new information. So we have post rate key, tag review position, and tag review score. This is the overall score of all these three criteria. All right, so let's take this number. And for example, in the amazing service, you can say points 92. Okay, so let's update this page again. Let's view the page. Right, so here's our page and here we have this information, the performance, the uh, on-time job and friendliness criteria. Alright, so change. let's change something else. Let's make it a percentage instead of image and update to see percentage of all these criteria. Here are the percentages and also let's make them points. Right, so now we have points instead of images and percentages. So 
as you can see there are a lot of room for playing around with this plugin don't forget to read the documentation and you can change the styling uh, so it will be looking very nice with your team all right so I would highly recommend this excellent plugin and you can use it for your website to review some products or services thank you very much for watching this video and you can visit my website tutorial7.com to learn more about WordPress, Joomla, web design and search engine optimization